everyone, more people know, I'm Adam Kovic. And I'm Bruce Green. And let's talk about some Witcher 3. Uh, is it better than Skyrim? Well, we're gonna find out. Really, so, right now? Oh, totally, because it is a good time to want to be a gravelly voice man <laughs> that stabs monsters and bones hot chips. <laughs> that sounds awesome. It totally is. A uh, gameplay trailer for Witcher 3 Wild Hunt released today, giving us a very rockstar styled overview of everything you can do in the game. It's mostly a woman's voice telling you why this game will be awesome. I like that. It's a pretty extensive list, actually, meaning we may have a new king of open world RPGs. So, the king. so this is making us ask, Will Witcher 3 be better than Skyrim, Lawrence? Uh, well, we don't know. The game's not out yet. That's true. Uh, we have to wait. But this is the internet, and ah. we, like everyone else, can make a thinly constructed argument of a versus list. Yes. Let's do it. All right, well, let's do it. Okay, let's go down the list of features. First up, banging. Uh huh. Witcher wins. Uh, fighting. Uh, Witcher wins. Horse riding. I, that's a tie. I don't know. Skyrim is the ones that you just go ride the mountain. It's pretty cool. Uh huh. Uh, wild hunting. Witcher wins. Oh yeah, totally. More banging. You better believe Witcher wins. Woohoo! <laughs> Three way. Uh, Witcher wins. Best game ever. Thank you for watching, everyone. Let's have a happy weekend. Shut the channel down. We're done. We're done. There's still more show. Ah uh, yeah, yeah. Don't worry. I know our viewers demand more in-depth, exacting analysis. They do. So, yes, they totally do. Oh, okay. Uh, and this is video games, guys. <laughs> This is important. This is this is real life. Actually, we're really excited about The Witcher, so we just want to talk about it. Uh, first off, Witcher 3 has a cool feature where you can domesticate the wilderness. Uh, yeah, by killing all the creatures in an area, loser idiots that are less cool than you will move in and set up towns. Oh, wow, that's This really will unlock cool. new armor and weapon shops and possibly new cum... Cumly lasses. Cumly lasses? Yeah. Fair winches! That's a thing. That's a oh, thing. This was written for Joel. <laughs> Why am I not reading the news? Uh, uh, so, new cumly lasses to your bed. Yeah. Uh, that's a mark for Witcher since Skyrim didn't really have world changing events based on player action. Uh, yeah, also to be fair, uh, Witcher 2 and Skyrim did come out the same year in 2011. All right, so why is that fair? They've had a lot of time to work on this. Oh, okay. <laughs> sure, you could choose cities to side with storm cloaks or Imperials, but mostly it just changed which NPC was sitting in the big chair. Next generation, baby. Yeah, Let's move right. over to the combat. Yeah. We got a slightly better look at the combat system in Witcher 3, which looks pretty similar to Witcher 2, mm -hmm. at least from the trailer. Yeah, how are those skills divided, Lawrence? Oh, just like Witcher 2, they talk about combat, magic, and alchemy kind of being the three tiers of the system. Mm -hmm. uh, you might think like in Skyrim you can just specialize in one, but if it's like Witcher 2, you'll pretty much have to use all three all the time Got it. to win because Jesus Christ, Witcher 2 was tough. It was Super really, tough. really yeah. difficult. I mean, you know, one of the more difficult games out there, so. Uh, so we're asking the question, is it better than Skyrim? We think this one will come down to taste. <laughs> yeah, totally. Skyrim certainly has more kinds of combat, but there aren't a lot of people out there just raving about Skyrim's intense fighting mechanics. I know I wasn't. Did you like Skyrim's fight? I know it you was did. okay. I played as an archer, so like- but you played really a ton matter. of it. You played a ton of it. Oh, totally. Yeah, yeah, just shoot people in the head. It's great. Uh, basically, you swatted an enemy for a few minutes, then choke back 18 cheese wheels. That's how Skyrim worked. Uh, yeah. Although it, it, was, it was fun, yeah. but you know, it wasn't exactly real. Right. Witcher will probably be your preference. It's like Skyrim with Dark Souls. Why'd you put that in the script? <laughs> uh, another difference that will come down to taste, Witcher 3 is way darker than Skyrim. Why is that, Lawrence? Oh boy. Well, so, so Skyrim has like necromancy and it's got, I'm gonna say it's kind of like got a little, like we're dabbling in dark stuff. Sure. But Witcher 3 is straight up like Game of Thrones, like people get fucked in this world. Like oh, creepy totally. girls drinking blood, Ooh. full on racist beatings. That's not very cool. No. Uh, I mean, it's, it's interesting. It's dark as shit. <laughs> yeah. So it's, it's like they don't really pull any punches when it comes to being as gnarly and fucked up as the human race can be. So if you, viewer, are getting to that age where dad just doesn't really understand you anymore, uh, Witcher 3's darker take on fantasy will probably appeal to you. That I'm getting to that age right now. What? We haven't talked about fucking in a while, so let's summarize the rest of this. Let's before yeah. we get to the fucking. <clears throat> uh, real quick, so crafting. Uh, yeah. This was my personal gripe with Witcher 2. Uh, word is that they've made it a lot better. How? Do we know what the word is, Lawrence? Well, so in Witcher 2, you would get these recipes that had all these ingredients and they wouldn't tell you where anything is and it was just kind of up to you to like read books and talk to people and find all that stuff. Okay. Yeah. It was pretty old school. Um, possibly in Witcher 3, they're gonna make it a little more approachable. Hopefully, we don't really know. Yeah. Okay. But in Skyrim, I don't know, the crafting was pretty bone dry. You would just get your pile of leather, you'd go and like scrape a, Scrape a hide for 10 minutes. Oh, you go mine some more for 50 hours. It's great. Uh, also, armor for Witcher 3. So oh. much options to look pretty. Uh, and obviously, you're more in third person than you were in Skyrim. Totally. So you kind of look at yourself and marvel at how yeah. beautiful you are. Uh, so, with some dialogue trees, this for me was the best part of Witcher 2. Oh. Your choices could actually unlock essentially two entirely different stories. Yeah. Uh, with the open world nature of Witcher 3, we're anticipating the never ending story. Yes. <laughs> Any, any chance we get to make a reference to that wonderful film? Finally fucking, we're getting to fucking. Oh boy. Two yeah. girls at once. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, next gen. And just yeah. imagine those mods. It's a video game, it's not real. Uh, there's gonna be mods and that might mean 
three girls. No! You shut three. your mouth! Three! Possibly, Lawrence. What about, what about four? Oh, no, 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 no. Come on now. Oh, that is okay. too much! Only three, Computers only can only do so much. Okay, only three. Geralt's girls. just a man. What if they turn Geralt into Richard. a woman and then. <gasps> It's all the then it would be four girls! Four women! He does have abs for days. I have a question. Do I need to have played Witcher 2 in order to enjoy Witcher 3? No, because you didn't have to play Witcher 1 to enjoy Witcher 2, like I didn't or did. You won't know what's going on with the Wild Hunt, you won't really know what's going on with Geralt, but odds are you won't care. You're just gonna run around, stab some monsters, and fuck some girls. All right, sign me up! What, what, do you think there could be uh, two girls and one guy in addition to Geralt? All right, let's get back on track. So the oh. question is... Skyrim versus Witcher. Uh -huh. Obviously, Witcher wins because it's the newer game. It's been in development for much longer. Yeah. And Skyrim's a very old game. But hopefully, this will be a crown. We will be crowning a new victor in the open world RPG landscape. I have heard rumors, though, that Elder Scrolls 6 is. Who told you that? I uh, just was reading it online. No big deal. So we might have a Witcher 3 versus Elder Scrolls 6. In other news today, League of Legends players uh, are really upset with Riot for the chromas and how expensive. Please they like are. and subscribe to the No Over to not listen to Joel talk about League of Legends. We will never talk about League of Legends on the show. We promise. What so. kind of nonsense is that? Unless it's interesting. Bye. Riot!